Today we're checking out the Sunlu AMS heater, a plug and play upgrade for your Bamboo Labs AMS, and it could save your multi-material dreams and your wallet. Now this is a demo unit that Sunlu sent us to test. Um, it is currently available for pre-order on the Sunlu site, and I will put the link in the description below if you are interested. But today we're going to install it on the Bamboo Labs AMS. So let's get it installed, but while we do that, let's talk about why it's important to keep your filament dry. Wet filament means stringing under extrusion, popping sounds, and failed layers. It's not just cosmetic, it can wreck functional prints too. Even though the AMS is sealed, it's not airtight. Over time, filament still absorbs moisture, especially when you live in humid environments. So we got the AMS heater installed, and as you can see, it's a, about the same height, a little bit higher than the actual cover of the AMS. But it does include the heater, and as you can see, it fits right on top of the unit. Um, now, I do want to say this also is a test unit, so it is not perfect, right? It is for testing purposes. But let's go through some of the features of the Sunlu AMS heater. One of the cool benefits of having an AMS heater is real-time drying. Now, what do I mean by that? No more dry than print routine where you dry your filament in a different dryer. Now you can dry everything in line to help with your workflow. Now the unit also has its own power supply. It runs independently with its own power supply Power off your printer, doesn't matter. It keeps drying on its own. So let's plug it in and check out some of the features. The onboard controllers let you set the type of material as well as temperature and the amount of time you want your heater to run. And it will automatically kick on and off at the hold numbers. So no overheating, no filament cooking, just stable dry spools. Now this is also designed to stack right on top of your printer like your regular AMS. It also has a sliding vent cover. The vent is to allow moisture and heated air to escape to prevent it from being reabsorbed by the filament. I also want to remind you this is a demo unit so it will not be what the final product will be. The final unit will have a transparent lid and other refined features. So is the Sunlu AMS heater worth it? I think so, but I dry my filament. So if you're chasing cleaner multi-material prints, hate babysitting filament, or live somewhere human, I think it is. If you want to check it out, I'll drop a link in the description below. They're currently taking pre-orders for the Sunlu AMS heater. For more on 3D printing, DIY, and maker projects, make sure you like and follow Maker Build It, and remember, keep on making.